Yo, what up dudes? Welcome back. My name is Beaker. How are you guys doing? What's good? Welcome back to Beaker's Lab, the number one uh, pro bunny rabbit pro gaming channel on YouTube in 2017. Now, I I'm sure you guys know that we do have a, a, a mascot here in Beaker's Lab. She's right here. Hang on. What's up, Lou? Yo, this is Lulu right here. You can see her, her ears are like, her ears are like flat right now. And that means that, that means it's chill. That means it's chill right now. There's no there's no auditory threats. There's no threats in the vicinity. So you put those ears down or 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 back. Put those ears down. It's like a convertible. You know, you got like a, a convertible Ford Mustang. It's sunny out, man. You're going to put that top back. You're going to chill. Let your let your blonde hair blow in the in the wind, you know what I mean? But if it's going to rain, you put that up, you're ready for anything. And speaking of ready for anything, guys, today is the Golem event in Clash of Clans. Now, I took yesterday off. There was some weird family stuff going on in my life, so I have not done this yet. We're going to do it right now. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to use my favorite Golem army. Now, I'm going to show you guys. You've seen it before. It is two Golems, two Lava Hounds, and the rest is Balloons and Wizards and a couple Wall Bakers. Guys, I love this army. And if you are looking for an army, especially with two Golems, this is... This is your army. <laughs> this this is your army right here, guys. So let's go ahead and do this, guys. We're going to do a couple of raids today. Try to get up in trophies and get some loot. Wait, do we have troops? What, what's good? Oh, yeah, we do. <laughs> look, at, look at that clan castle, man. Three Valks, one bowler. I love it. All right, guys, let's go. So, um, wow. It's getting warm in here. You know, it's actually not getting warm in here. Well, the problem is I just ate way too much food. So... I, I started making tater tots, right? And I made a, a giant plate of tater tots because that was all I was going to eat. I'm like, I'll make a meal out of tater tots. It's totally normal. But then I looked in the fridge and I realized I had some awesome, awesome leftover mac and cheese from a, from a restaurant I ate at yesterday. So I'm like, okay, okay, I'll have tater tots and mac and cheese. But then I started thinking like, dude, I got to get some vegetables in here. Like I can't just eat these things. So I made some peas, put those on, on top of everything, right? So at this point, I had way, way too much food, but I'm like, hey, I need something to drink, okay? So I got out the blender, <laughs> and I made a smoothie, which, you know, a smoothie in itself is probably a meal. So, yeah, long story short, I ate all of that, and now I feel like I'm, I'm dying. I feel like I'm going to puke. I'm kind of sweating, but I'm also cold, <laughs> but, but it was pretty good. It was, it was pretty good. Can we find a good base? Can Oh, oh, oh my, oh, so we're going to hit this base pretty hard from the top. Then we're going to go in from the bottom with the air attack. Let's get it. Here we go. So it looks like the explosives are pointed down. That is good for us. That's good for our balloons. But we are going to make a little, little precision shot in here. Let's go. I'm going to drop one golem right there. Boom, boom, boom. Let's get it. There's a couple wizards behind those golems. Here we go. All right, yo, yeah, uh, come on, guys, come on. Okay, let's get right in here. Go, go, go. Oh, man. Yo, I realize I have a jump spell, and I don't really need that jump spell. I might I might use it. We'll see. We'll see what happens. But I, I don't think I'm really going to need that jump spell. We'll see, though. You know what I am going to do? I'm going to drop the king in this side little pocket here. Check this out. Get in there, king. Get in there, king. Yeah, that is sick, dude. He, he just walked right... Oh, man, that was sick. Let's see if we can get him to jump over and take out some of those Teslas. <laughs> oh, wow. That did not work at all. Oh, and now... Oh, oh, man. <laughs> oh, oh, no. Okay, uh, guys, we got to get going here. So let's drop a couple of Lava Hounds. Get in there, dudes. Get in there, dudes. Okay, hey, Spell. Hey, Spell. Oh! No, go where I want you to go. go oh, oh. Okay, another hay spell. Get it, get it, get it. Oh! Oh my god. I'm gonna drop this, this, gr oh! No, they didn't go where I wanted them to go, oh my god! Get in there! Ah! I wanted the Valkyries to go into the middle here to help out in the middle. Oh my god. Oh my god, I forgot there was another air defense! Mm. I cannot believe I forgot about that, that other air defense. I cannot believe I forgot about that other air defense. Oh my god! I am so angry at myself for forgetting that other air defense. I don't really know how I forgot that other air defense. I guess I thought I was going to take that one out for some strange reason. I thought that one was going to get taken out. I don't know why it would get taken out. 
And, and you know the worst part about this is, uh, th this guy is like, yo, my base is sick. My base is dope. Look at this. This guy, Beaker's Lab, I think he has a, a terrible YouTube channel. He hit up my base and he failed. <laughs> Which I did fail, by the way. <laughs> you cannot, you cannot deny that. But we do have some Valkyries here. What are they gonna do? Oh my god, what, what are you Valkyries doing? Okay, they, they took out the king. I can't believe there's still multiple Valkyries. Can they get the town hall? That would be so sick. There's no way they're gonna get the town hall, but they're probably gonna get a couple of hits on it. Get in there, get in there, get in there. Oh my god, look at all those traps. Oh my god. Oh, take them out, dudes. Oh, that was crazy. That was crazy. So we ended up at 88%. I'm telling you guys, if we had taken out that final air defense, this would have been fine. This would have been fine. We would have gotten the three. I just, I just went totally stupid. Just 100% stupid. Let's move on, guys, and try to get uh, a couple of two, uh, three stars today. We're going to try to get some three stars. Yeah, hopefully to redeem ourselves. Let's go. Is there any other gaming channels that also have a live bunny as a mascot? I don't, I don't know. There probably is. There probably is. Thank you to Unity Sharp. Uh, by the way, if you guys don't know, people ask me this all the time. Who made the Unity clans? Was it Beaker? Well, the truth is, Unity Sharp, you can kind of tell by the name, right? Unity Sharp is the guy who actually made the Unity clans. I came by a little bit after that, and he was uh, he was a cool dude, so we got along well, and, and we expanded the clans, made them what they are today. Then we wrecked a couple of the clans, <laughs> then, we, then we made some more clans, you know, normal stuff. Anyway, guys, looks like we're ready to go. Let's do this. Guys, this is perfect. <laughs> What's this dude's name? I, um, Keith. I love it. I love it. I don't know what it's a reference to, if it is a reference to anything. Uh, but I also love this base. I think we can crush this base and actually get the three. I think there is no question that we can take out two air defense on this base. Let's go. Let's go do it. Here's the plan. We're gonna drop, uh... We're gonna drop the queen first, take out that, that builder shot right there. Then we are gonna drop some, uh, what are these called? Oh yeah, golems. <laughs> That's right. Let's drop some wizards right behind. Uh, let's get some over here. Go, go, go. Okay, cool. Cool, super cool. Okay, so we're, we're taking stuff out here. Let's get some wall breakers in there. Hit it. Yes, okay. So we needed to get the, the middle open here because uh, we, we need to get in to this middle area here. What I think I'm gonna do is, is try to jump all the way into the middle and we can do that very easily because we have a jump spell and we have some Valkyries and Valkyries just love to like do whatever you want them to do. If you set down a jump spell, your Valkyries are gonna go exactly where you want. You know, I dropped the poison there, didn't really need it, but I, it doesn't matter. I don't really, I don't really need a, a, a poison spell. Okay guys, let's drop a, a balloon right there. Whoa, who's? What's good? What's what's happening in there, man? Oh my god, the king just died so so fast. So we're gonna drop a, a hound right here. Let's get some blue. Oh, queen, don't die! Don't die on me! Don't die on me, bro. Okay, let's get a uh, hay spell. Hay spell in there. Now you can see we're trying to drop a couple of balloons on each defense. You want to be kind of precise about that, and you know if if you're not totally precise, whatever, it's all good. But uh, when you're doing a raid like this, definitely try to be as precise as you can because if you miss one defense, it's gonna screw screw you up big time, man. Big time. So, uh, let's drop one more Rage Bell. I think we can get through this with just this one Rage Bell. Well, let's not try to push that. <laughs> Either we can or we can't. Oh my god. Oh, we get... Oh my god. Dude. Oh! Ho -ho. Guys, so we did this without using one of our Rage Bells. Wait, you guys know what's gonna happen next? Where, where should we put this Rage Bell? Um, okay. Oh, dude, I almost just puked. I ate way too much earlier. Ugh. It's not good, guys. It's not good. But what we are gonna do right now... Oh! <laughs> yes! I don't think I've ever done that before. I don't think I... And, and, that, and you can't look at that and be like... Oh, what a noob. He accidentally put that in the corner. No, that was so deliberate. There is no question that I meant to do that. I, Yum Keith, is like, wow, this Beaker guy, he's... He's a, he's a genius. He, he, it's almost like art, you know? Put the spell in the corner. And look at that. Final one. Boom. So we got the three star, guys. We sort of redeemed ourselves for the first failed raid. It was not that failed, but it was failed. Let's be honest. This one was much better, and we were able to do it really without even needing one of our raid spells. Let's go do this again. 
Oh, dude, I almost just... I don't think I almost puked, but I, like, sort of hiccuped and, like, it was not good. Oh! Oh. I'm not... Not really doing good, guys. <laughs> Ugh. See, if I had something to drink that would help, but the only thing I have is smoothie here. And, like, if you're about to sort of puke, you don't really want to drink more smoothie. Yeah. Okay, guys, this is my favorite base right here. We're going to hit this up. Now, I normally hit this up with a queen walk. It is such a beautiful base to hit with a queen walk, but we don't have that. But we do have a pretty good army. So let's try to get in here and take out the enemy queen. I would say that's going to be our main goal. Let's start right here. Right here. Okay, cool. Now we're going to drop a wizard right there, a wizard right there. We're going to do the same thing over here. We're going to drop a uh, golem. No, 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 go oh, no. The golem went way too wide. Oh, uh, he went wide. He went way wide. Oh, no, <laughs> no, no, that was so bad. Okay, so guys, we got to make up for that with the king, I guess. I guess the king is going to be our, our dude, our dude. Our king is going to be our dude. Does that make sense? Yeah, okay, cool. So let's drop the clan castle. It should have uh, some stuff in it. Cool, awesome. And we got to get in there and kill the queen. Get in there, get in there. Boom. Get wow, that took way too long. But I think we are good, guys. We're, we're closing in on the two minute mark. And you guys that watch the channel, you know I always wait till about two minutes until I start the actual raid or the air part of the raid. Now, you know what would be cool, guys? If we could take out this other air defense. Yeah, no, that doesn't seem to be happening. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Okay, so let's drop in some more troops in the form of balloons. Get in there, dudes. And should we drop another lava hound? <laughs> I just sounded like somebody on the news. Should we drop another lava hound? No, we should not. We're going to drop it right there, though. And we're going to drop uh, some more in on the corners here. This is another tip that really helped me when I was trying to learn air attacks, guys. You want to drop most of your balloons on the corners. Now, that's an oversimplified way to look at it, but if you drop almost all your troops from the corners, spread out, not in one spot, but if you drop almost all your troops from the corners, you're going to do pretty good. Just saying. Oh, no! Okay, we're good. We're so good, dude. Oh, yes! Wow. Wow, we just crushed this one, man. And we do have another spell, as always. We have another spell that we can stunt on something. Um, Stunting like my daddy. I'll be stunting like my daddy. You guys, you guys listen to terrible rap from the 90s? I don't know if that's terrible rap. Who, who was that? Is it Lil Wayne? Like with Lil Wayne and Birdman or something? I don't know. Anyway, stunt like my daddy. I'm the number one stunner. Let's drop this over here and get it on that tree. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Oh! <laughs> I love it. I hope you guys love it too. Lulu, what are you doing? She's like coming out of her box. What, what are you doing? What's up? You know, sometimes Lulu comes out of the box. She has this little box. This is a cardboard box, but she comes out of the box and she starts to put her paws on the iPad when I'm playing. And it's like, what? Like, what do you, what do you? She does the same thing with the computer monitors, which is, there's one right behind her. Whoa, we just leveled up. That was really weird. Why did that just level me up? Lulu, what's good? I don't know, man. Anyway, another 100% and we got some sick loot and we got a good loot bonus and we got some trophies, 19 trophies. Lulu, what's good? It's an amazing day, man. This is an amazing day. So, Vendetta, thank you for uh, all the loot and the stuff and the... What's that clan? Is that Russian? I guess I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> hey, I suck. I only know English. I'm sorry. Anyway, guys, uh, that's going to be it for today. We got the gems. We got the XP. That's awesome. So that's why we leveled up. Oh, I feel like I'm going to puke. Oh, I just got this like wave of like... If you guys didn't hear in the earlier part of the show... I ate far too much right before doing this. And now I feel like I'm gonna puke. That being said, I think we're done for today, guys. Hope you enjoyed today. Let me know if you did. Uh, what What is next? I think I just, oh yeah, the jump spell event is in two days. That's gonna be pretty fun. I hope it's like, use two jump spells in a raid because just one, don't, don't tell us to just use one jump spell. That would be really lame. I wanna do some raids for that that have like two or three jumps. There's definitely some that I can, think of. Cool. Anyway, guys, hope you're doing good out there. Let me know how you are. We will see you guys tomorrow. We will be surely back tomorrow. What's tomorrow? Saturday? No, today's Saturday. Oh my God. So I got to do a Saturday with Beak episode real soon. I will do that. Maybe we'll do it tomorrow and it'll be a belated Saturday with Beak. I'll see you guys then. Peace.